New tonight, a new type of handgun made with new technology is raising some serious concerns and questions, including here in New York State with the SAFE Act. Good evening, I'm Kelly Dudzik. Two on your side's Ron Plants got input tonight from a firearms expert on the plastic guns made using 3D printers. A Tupperware gun. I mean, that's one way I look at them. NRA qualified handgun instructor and attorney Scott Miller knows weapons and how they work. There is 40 to 50,000 pounds of pressure when a lead bullet discharges from a barrel. So with one of these plastic guns? And although they may be strong enough for a, a couple of shots, it's not going to be the same as metal. Of course, the biggest concern for someone who actually knows about firearms is that these 3D printed plastic guns could actually fail and end up hurting the person who is actually shooting it. Possibly, depending on the plastics being used. I think the plans that are available will tell you what particular uh, plastics to be used when you make these. Those plans coming from a man who first produced and publicized plastic guns in 2013 and fought a five-year legal battle with the federal government over gun trafficking laws. The feds eventually backed off on First and Second Amendment arguments. Perhaps an individual revolt against the government, just simply saying, I can do this and you can't stop me. So what about criminals making them? If you're looking at a criminal element, they would have to have the internet, they would have to buy a 3D printer, They'd have to know how to do the 3D scanning to scan that in, which I think is all pretty sophisticated. In New York State, if you 3D printed a handgun, you would still have to have it registered. I don't know how the state would handle that because there isn't a serial number on it. So they would ask to have a number put onto it. Um, and then the caliber, of course, and the manufacturer would be homemade. That was our Ron Plants reporting. New York State Police agree on the need for registration and also say any rifle deemed to be an assault weapon that's made would be illegal.